Hey guys, Bear Love here, and welcome back to my Let's Play Majora's Mask. In the last episode, we got here to Woodfall Temple. Well, no, we didn't. We, f we finished up here in Woodfall Temple, defeating Odalwa, and right before collecting this mask here. In this episode, let's do it. You seized Odalwa's remains. You have just freed the innocent spirit that this dark mask has kept in prison within the body of evil Odalwa. So. We've rescued a spirit, apparently, it says. Oh, it must be pretty evil looking in this mask. What? Um, so this is the face of evil, apparently. Like bubbles and like really peaceful music playing. I don't understand that. It's like it's supposed to be like the inside of the mask. There's like bubbles. It's all nice. What's that? How do you see through that? I don't know if he's like supposed to be inside that, but we like see right through it. Oh my god, good. What the hell is this? What? Jeez, what the? Is this what Tattle or not? What Tail was talking about? Wait, listen, god damn it. He seems to be saying something. Could that kind be its way of teaching us some sort of melody, you idiot? Don't just stand there, dumbass. Get your instrument. Okay, we got it. So it seems to be trying to teach a song, and Tattle just totally deciphered that. Well done, Tattle. And Tattle turned into the... I don't know, conductor. So let's play this song. I was totally assuming it's a song, but... Eh, we played it. Yeah, so I, I don't even understand why it's so peaceful in this mask. You'll see later why it's even more confusing why it's so peaceful, but Oster Order. So this giant here apparently taught us Oath to Order. And for some reason Tattle just totally understands this thing. I don't know what that was, like it's like shampoo or something, like that's why all the bubbles are everywhere. You learn the oath to order. And it's like, that's a shitty song, why do you, that's not supposed to be a song. And it goes berserk. And boss fight number two comes up. No, it doesn't. It's just getting pissed off for no reason. It's like constipated. Call us. That's what it's saying, god damn it. Oh really, Tattle just all of a sudden knows how to speak giant. Ah, uh, whatever. Okay, back out here at Woodfall. We defeated Odawa, so all the water gets cleared of all the poison. And get a nice little music there. And everything returns to normal. Until these pathways emerge. And back into Woodfall we go. I know, it. we saved the Southern Swamp. Yeah, I think God, I was thinking of putting this all in the last episode. Good thing I didn't. The four people Tail talked about. You think it was talking about those spirits that were still inside the mask? God damn it. Oh, hey, you were pretty good out there. Have you done this before or what? Maybe. You know, once or twice, maybe. Now just keep up that pace and save the other three, god damn it. Hey, um. She, was, she does the same animation here. I always thought that was weird. They just got lazy and she did the same animation three times there. All the stuff I did to you, um, your horse, that dumb bastard, I, I apologize. Sorry, dumbass. There, I apologize, bastard. So don't hold it against me, got it? Now then, we've helped the princess, just like the monkey ass. So now our next step is to the mountains. Let's hurry and do something with that skull kid, goddammit. But we didn't save the princess, we saved Southern Swamp, but watch this. This is boss number two. Let's get in there. But wait, oh good, what is this? What the hell? What? Who are you? Link, pleased to meet you. I am the Deku Princess. And we do a little bow. Will you by chance ask that monkey, bah, ask by that monkey to come save me? Aha, just as I suspected. You see, your body smells a little bit like, so you smelled us. Well, that's one way to go about it, I guess, you little dog. So the monkey made it back flying after all, that's good. Well, not really. Mm, kinda got captured by your dad. 
I was worried that when I didn't come home, my father would think that monkey had kidnapped me. Well, I was worried that my father would even go as far as to punish the poor monkey. Well, oh god. Well, you're not gonna like what I have to say then. Don't tell me. Are you serious? Is father actually doing that? Yet another hasty decision, father? And she gets all pissed about it. Well, we haven't any time to lose. Quickly, Mr. Link, could you please find something to carry me so that you take me to dick? Did you want me to carry you? Like, what is this? But, we do have something to carry you, and it is... You guessed it. We gotta release this Freddy first, because... Um... Like, going against all physics here, we go like... Boom. And we get the Deku Princess in a bottle. It's a tight fit, but she says she'll be fine. Uh, Mr. Link, there's no time to lose. Uh, uh, take me to the palace. I don't know how I made the place that. Okay, so now that we have the Deku Princess in a bottle, let's head over to the palace before she dies of suffocation. Or we can go find that great fairy that needs those stray fairies first. Which is a much better idea. So... Now that all the poison's gone, we can swim in here, but even swimming in here, there's no real point to it, so... Let's start heading to that cave. The cave is actually near where we entered um, Woodfall, so... There's no more enemies down here, because all the... It's all good and pure now. So, yeah, you see the cave over there to the left, so we just gotta head on over there. Okay, we're almost there, so... This is the cave you want to go to, so... If you come here before the Woodfall Temple, it pretty much just tell you, oh, you gotta collect the fairies, the stray fairies in Woodfall Temple, so... Yeah, you just collect them first and come here after. Let's yeah, see what we got here. Got some stray fairies, and we release all of ours. They all look the same. And they combine their power to make... more beauty! There we go. Imagine if it was on the Wii, that'd be so, like... I don't even know if that'd fly with Nintendo and all its rights, but anyway. Oh, strong young one. I'm the great fairy power. Sorry I don't have the voice that Shadow did, but thank you for returning my broken and shattered body to normal. That's thanks. I grant you powerless over the new solar technique. New solar technique, eh? Assuming I have a sword anyway, she just looks at this deck. Ah, oh, he's got a sword somewhere. And she gets us all drunk. Because it's all drunk off with love. I don't know what I was going for there. Okay, there we go, and manly chest pump. You mastered the spin attack. So yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We get the spin attack that we had by default in Ocarina of Time, but we had to unlock in this game. Come see me again whenever you are overcome by weariness. We're never coming back here. Okay, so let's see what this big old spin attack is. Hold B. And yeah, that's it. We did all that work for that. So, Woodfall Temple, you don't get the best prize ever for your work, but, you know, it's the first temple. You gotta cut her some slack here. She's trying her best. But anyway, so now that we've got that, I know there's a heart container here somewhere. Spoiler, not a heart container, a heart piece here somewhere. I believe it's right over here. Yeah, I think it's in that chest over there. If it's not... There's another chest over there. Yeah, over there. Oh, I can't really see it from here, but I'm pretty sure that that chest contains just some loopies that will always be there every time you restart the three-day cycle. So no need for that, but we do have some need for this. Oh yeah, it has to be it. I like how it's a deck you just jump right on in. Oh, treasures dive into the treasure. There we go. We get a piece of heart. Okay, so now. Why did I do that? Oh, come on. Damn it. Oh well. We'll just swim as Link. So now that we've got that, let's head to the Deku Palace and get the princess there. Oh wait, we got a treasure chest here. And I think this one's just like 20 rupees. Called it! Okay, so I'll meet you guys back at the Deku Palace. Okay, here we are back at the Deku Palace. So let's head on in here and Give them their princess. But wait, oh good god, what is going on here? Well, I want to show this. Punishment, punishment. Jeez, oh, they're like some crazy cult here. But hold on, I want to... No, not, not the stupid... Get out of here. You can talk to the monkey. I want to talk to the monkey. There we go. 
Oh, hot, hot, stop, please. They keep saying that I kidnapped her. No matter how many times they say it, it's not gonna bring the princess back. And oh god. And he just like, ugh. No, he's not dead. I don't know why they did that. He just like stays like paralyzed for a bit, then he comes back to they like just dunk him in the boiling water. I always thought that was pretty pretty like brutal. They're like boiling a monkey, like come on. It's pretty pretty bad I gotta say, but Okay, fine, princess, we'll let her out here. Drop her off in front of her paw. And we're like fusing with her. The loin cloth of leaves. Oh my princess, my darling princess, you are alright? I was so worried. A foolish, foolish father, what's the door? No, it's more like, uh, this is Sparta, this, this is Deku Palace, I don't know. But she like jumps on him and is like, Jesus. What are you doing? Let that monkey go this instant. And they scramble down like idiots. And he probably, one of them probably caught fire from that huge fire because I made a word. But nope, the monkey's fine. After being boiled, he's all right. Oh, Mr. Monkey, I am truly sorry. Father does such rash things when he's worried about me. Oh, I understand, Princess. Forget about that. Has the temple been returned to normal? Oh, yes. Thanks to Mr. Link here. I am very truly grateful. Really? So you're called Link, are you? Thank you for keeping your promise to me. And his little weird bowing was like, yeah. As a symbol of our gratitude, our butler has prepared something for you. Please accept it. You'll find a shrine that will be too late when you leave the palace. Cool. Okay, so all is well, seems to be well here. But actually, it might look like this is all that you have to do all this. Returning the princess here is actually totally optional. Even though as long as like much as it would look like you have to do this, you don't have to rescue the princess. You don't have to rescue that monkey at all. All you have to do is get Odala's remains and hell, you can you just head on out and head back to clock down. Damn well feel like it. Cause yeah, you got what we got what Link wants, that's pretty much it. We're just doing this as being a good citizen. But this is the shrine she wants to come to, cause the butler apparently has something for us. So this place can get a little annoying, as you'll see, as the butler talks. Well, Link, I am truly thankful for what you've done for the princess. As a sign of our gratitude, we deco up a bit, something that we think may assist you. I will lead you to it. And please follow me. And this is a very annoying race, just like in Ocarina Time where you had to follow Dompe, the gravekeeper, to the prize at the end. This is the exact same thing, except this is optional. You don't have to do this, this is just for a super secret prize. This one's a lot harder than the one in Ocarina Time, though. There's a lot of tricks you have to do here, and it's a lot longer. It's easy to get lost in here, as I hope I don't. Cause I really don't want to have to do this again. Ooh, all these Deku's are here, they don't attack you, just... It's all right. And this, you have to switch to Link here. Don't fall, thank you, I almost fell. Oh god, oh god, don't... If you uh, do a roll like that before you jump, you actually get a lot more air than you would just regular jumping. So that's why I was like jumping like that. Actually, let's get back to Deku. It's easier to maneuver, I find, with the Deku. It's faster than Link. Okay, this way. I don't believe touching those fires hurts you, but don't quote me on that. Don't bother trying. Because if you get burned to the Deku, actually, like, as if you fell in a pit or something, you just, like, pass out and die. Well, not die, but close, come come pretty damn close to dying. Okay. Don't. Yeah, this is where it says getting a little tricky. You gotta make sure you see where, which way he goes. Because there's multiple directions and some are dead. In. Oh, in this place. You gotta do a little. Yeah, there's fiery walls of doom here. I make sure to stay close behind Mr. Mr. Butler. Even as Link, you can't run through those walls of fire. You'll just like get repelled. So that one could be a little annoying. Okay. Still going strong, guys. Ooh, boulders of doom. Okay. No more boulders of doom. Now steep hills of doom. Okay, this place. Gotta make sure you go this way. This this is the room where a lot of failures happened for me as a kid, but not this time. Not this time, you old fool. Okay, this is where we gotta switch back to Link. And we gotta shoot this right here. Shoot it. Go, and then puts the fire down. And we gotta get over this. You can't jump as a Deku, so keep that in mind for these parts. Crap, crap, crap. Hurry up. Switch back to Link. I mean, Deku Link. And go, 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 go. Damn it, Butler, I can just wait up. 
Okay, I think this part is like, there's no way to like get lost in here. It's, it's just a square. And, oh, we made it. Whew, we did it. Let's go. Thank God. Okay, let's see. Well done, Link. No, here is the item I promised. Please accept it. Did you really have to bring him away in here just to give me this? But anyways, this is the Mask of Sense. I like the Mask of Uselessness because there's really not very much you can do with this mask. But I want to collect all the masks, so I came here anyway. Actually, when I see you, I am reminded of my son who left home long ago. Somehow I feel as if I am once again racing with my son. I am afraid I may have tried too hard out on you. As old as I am, I am still a fast competitor, just like when I race my son. Please forgive my rudeness. I'm sorry that you had to race your son in some death trap like this. But let's go in here now. Let's get the hell out of here. What time are we at now? It must be. Holy crap, we're getting pretty old one time. Okay. Question of the video. Um. Uh. Ooh. Question of the video. Oh my god, I, I honestly can't think of a question of the video today. Okay, so, question of the video. Um, yeah, how would you guys like to, like, make questions of the video? Like, just leave some, I don't know, comments on my channel or something. Leave some questions of the video. Or do you want me to make one up every time? Because I, as you've noticed, I've made some pretty stupid ones. So yeah, if you guys want to leave some comments anywhere in this, on this video in my channel, send me a message about questions you'd like me to ask so yeah so yeah leave your questions in the comments below so anyways so we got enough done here we defeated well we got the giant song well oath of order so if you like the video give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more videos in the future make sure to hit the subscribe button so it's been the better level let's play majora's mask and we will do some other stuff next time later guys